proud of you, Maddie. You did so well. He just said he has to go potty. So we are back at home now. Shout out to my little dancer. So proud of her. You did so well, my mom. Ooh, she said she knows. <laughs> so how's it feel? Awesome. Yeah, so I'm kind of sad I don't have any more classes because I, I, I really like to jazz and Okay, well, I mean, you can always do it again next year. Yeah, I want to do four dances next year. I want to do hip hop, jazz, ballet, and tumbling. I could quit hip hop, but I choose not to because I want to learn head spins next year. You want to do head spins? Yeah, teacher actually told us. But um, I mean, even if I quit hip hop, I'd still be doing ballet, which has my friends Sophie and Zoe. And Zoe's Sophie's in my hip hop, and Zoe's in my in my jazz. So I'd have both. But of them Zoe, it's Zoe, not your Zoe. <laughs> Okay, well, we'll talk about it. The way Sophie and Zoe talk about their ballet, they're saying it's... Ballet. Ballet. Okay. They're saying it's fast. Yeah, it's, I, I, I did ballet I, I for... Think, I did ballet for, what, 15 years? I think I, I didn't did like mine when I was little because I was only little, so I mm -hmm. could only go so fast. Yeah, but you were only 
You were three when you started. Yeah. And four. All right, well, we'll get you set up. Don't worry. All right, you guys, so we are back at home now. Recital time, dance is over. That was the last activity with the kids. Uh, just because there's not a lot of summer camps, so at least I don't know if any summer camps going on. We'll save some extra money and just travel and do fun stuff as a family, especially since the big guys on paternity leave and enjoy because it was just perfect timing. So here's Chill here. He was such a good boy at the dance recital. He was such a good boy at the recital. Right he didn't my, cry. Right before my jazz dance, I heard him cry for like seconds. Well, that must have been another baby because he was he was just making noises and all that. Uh, well, I hope you guys are doing well. So I'm not gonna tell your heads off because my head is hurting. Like I just been having like neck tension or headaches in my neck for the past couple of days. I was fine yesterday, perfectly fine, thank God. But then it just started happening again today. So big guy went to bed because he's not feeling well either. So but um yeah so we're just chilling and relaxing i'm so proud of my girl she did so well and i'm just very very proud of her because the last time she had dance we were in maryland and so that was what back in 2018 yeah that was the last time that she did dance and so we asked her if she wanted to do it again and she said yes so i'm so proud of her and look forward to seeing her dance some more so I guess we need, to, we need to start doing more TikTok dances so we can help you with your hip hop. <laughs> That'll be free hip hop classes. And there's Tristan. Say hi, Bubba. <laughs> so yeah, you guys. So I'm about to get ready for the night and get these kids ready for bed. Get myself ready for bed because I just pray my head feels better. It's hard of having headaches. Lord have mercy. But um, yeah, so we're about to get ready for bed. I don't think I'm gonna stay up and edit, and I didn't get much footage to even. I don't think I got much footage to put a whole vlog together. So how um, continue vlogging tomorrow, and then I'll have a vlog for you guys on Monday because y'all said post whenever I can. So I hate not being on the schedule, but I'm so glad that you guys are okay. So I always tell you guys, please have your notifications on and hit that bell twice. So that way you're notified every time I post a video. You and mean, you don't miss out or anything. You guys need to take the orca back his home. Yeah. He loves orcas, I told y'all. Let me hang out with my babies, get ready for the night, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Oh, Lord, here they come. <laughs> come on. Come say goodnight. Justin, come say goodnight. Bye. Peace. Cheese. Bye, y'all. Bye. Good night. Peace. Wait, wait, wait. It is 3.15 in the morning and I am up still doing my hair and I am only halfway done. Like I just finished this side, I know I look like crisscross. I look like crisscross from back in the day when they had their hair like this. <laughs> but um, I'm halfway done. So I'm doing goddess, boho, bohemian goddess, faux locks. And so, I'm doing something totally different and out of my comfort zone. So I'm using this color. I really hope that it looks good on my hair because typically I'll get like one, one B just because it's something simple. But this is T27. I'll link it down below in case you're interested in this color. Because I was like, I want to do something different from this summer, especially with us traveling a lot. I want to do something different out of my comfort zone. And also I wanted to do um individuals so i was going to do like just the perimeters of my hair and then um do crochet so i'm going to so that i'm doing individual crochet locks just because no shade to the crochet goals and all of that but i prefer 
I don't know, I just like the individual boxes better. Um, just so I can have my hair up and you know, I can do different styles and everything. But when you like braid it down and then cornrow it, I think it's more so the front. I can't, when I do my crochets, I can't stand how it looks in the front. So I was okay, well, let me just do the individuals. So I'm trying to do not too many, but as many because I have like six packs. The six packs that came in here. And I feel like I'm going to have so much hair left. So we shall see. I'm super excited to see how this color is going to look. This is, like I said, T27. So I'm nervous because I've never had, I don't think I've ever had this color, but we'll see. So yeah, it's 3.15, y'all. And I think I'm just going to, because if I try to finish it all, I'm not going to be done until 5 in the morning. And I know Troy's going to be waking up. Like, it's crazy how this is like the only time I really have to myself. Because in the daytime, when he's napping, I'm spending time with my other kids and my husband and everything. But at night, it's like I'm up. And then I told you off my headache. I had a headache. And what helps me is um, because I can't take anything with aspirin. And I can't, I mean, I could take naproxen, but I don't think it's safe right now. So um, I can take ibuprofen and anything without aspirin. So I've been taking Excedrin tension headache and that helps to the gods. It's a cinnamon and caffeine. And so, since I took caffeine, that's probably why I'm up, but I'm gonna pay for it in the morning. <laughs> so hopefully I can have this done and I can at least get some sleep before we go to church. Um, we might have to go to a later service, I don't know. But yeah, so I just wanna check in, let you guys know what time it is. Yep, it's 3, 3.26, so I'm over here. So I've been catching up on vlogs. I just finished watching my fine bae, Sophieology. Sophia, I love her. Now I'm watching Tierra Monet, her recent vlog. So I'm just catching up because I love watching my faves' vlogs. Lord's willing, I'll be able to meet them one day. Nice to be invited to events and social gatherings. Now that things are getting better, so I can meet people me my favorite vloggers and bloggers influencers meet you guys so lord's willing that would will happen but um but you yeah, know no when you don't have a social life where you live and those no blogger events and stuff kind of sucks because you know, like everybody's ever since like there's so many blogger events and people going outside and it's just like bro like I wish I was there, but I can't <laughs> because ain't nothing going on here. Hey guys, it is the next day. Um, just been tired and not really doing much. Um, did take the kids to the pool yesterday for um, uh, it's a potluck. I was like, what is it? So we went for a potluck Mommy, with one of Tristan's over? friends, his girlfriend at school. Over? So that was fun. So we're here in the room. So, uh, I forgot to end the vlog. So I was like, well, let me just end it because I have to edit it and have it posted for you guys. Because I need to, you know, stay consistent or try my best to stay consistent. So yeah, so I'm about to get these kids ready for bed. Jesse, I have laundry to put up. I have laundry to put up. Got baby boys clothes to put up. So I still have a lot to get done. Before, at least I did my hair, finally. I didn't have it hanging down, but I've been cleaning all day and just getting stuff done around the house. So it's not heavy at all. It's not heavy at all. So it's not heavy at all, which is nice, especially for this heat. But because I've been bending down and picking stuff up off the floor, I just, you know, having it all over the place. So I love you guys. I love it so much. I was nervous about the color. Cause I was like, oh my gosh, you know, I've never had anything like when it comes to like crochets and stuff, and they have never had anything bright like this. But I like it, so I'm super excited to style it and everything. So, anyways, you guys gotta get this laundry put up, get our suitcases packed because we're going on the road again. So, if you guys can guess where we're going next, then let me know in the comments and all that. And baby boy is ready to get in bed. All right, kids, y'all ready for bed? Okay. Well, y'all, so baby calls, so let me go ahead and go. Hope you guys are doing well. Have a wonderful, blessed week. I'll 
us and let me know down below where you think we're going. I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh my gosh, it's so much chaos right now. So as you know, postpartum has been kicking my butt. So pray for me, okay? <laughs> All right, you guys. See you next one. Bye.